previously on Season of the Witch. Edgar visited Rowan. He said he wants to be with him, no matter what. He would give up immortality to be with him. Rowan said he should think about it, but Edgar knows what he wants. And Rowan wants him too. Rowan promised to find a cure for Edgar. Rowan asked Edgar to go out on a date on Love Day. And then he proposed to him. Edgar said yes. Morgan invited him to go to a festival, and when they got there, Rowan realized it was the romance festival. He told them that he's engaged now and can't be with Morgan. When it was getting dark, Rowan invited Edgar to come. In the heat of the moment, they got married at the romance festival. Another fox has shown up, and I see that they really like Valyrian root. Edgar close the garlic rowan is gonna use to make the cure. He's not happy, but he just wants to be close to his love. They barely got married, and Edgar has a want to have a baby with him. Rowan loves his bees, and he isn't afraid of them. Rowan is still reading the vampire tomes. I guess the heat waves got into him. But Edgar keeps distracting Rowan. Eddie, this is for your own good, baby. Let the man read the tomes. I know it's your honeymoon, but please. Victoria wants to give Edgar's number to one of her friends. Excuse me? No, Vicky. He's married now. And then, Morgan invited themselves to come here. I said yes. Who you up for night? Good morning. Papa Day. Because Rowan still needs to be friends with the sages. Rowan had to go to the bathroom and left Eddie and Morgan uncomfortable there. But I guess Edgar and Morgan are kind of outgoing sims. And all of a sudden, Edgar wanted to show his skills to Morgan. I don't know what for. Rowan ordered pizza. The pizza guy doesn't look happy. Now he's smiling. He probably wants a nice tip. Rowan didn't give him any. Sad boy. He invited Morgan to eat with him. Edgar can't stop doing sit-ups. I guess he decided to eat pizza with them. Morgan is trying to act cool. Rowan asked Morgan for magical training. But for some reason, they were in different rooms for that. We just love Sims, don't we? Oh well, Edgar wants to drink for Morgan. And because I love chaos, I made it happen. For some reason, I thought they would refuse it. However, they accepted it willingly. I think Morgan still likes Rowan, and in their mind, he's the only one feeding Edgar, and they want to give Rowan a break from this pain. Edgar was pretty satisfied with this plasma. Morgan chose a movie to watch. Rowan was asleep at the moment. 
so Edgar made them company. They were quickly becoming friends. The movie ended and this are leaning to another direction, I see. I'm letting them do their things. Edgar is interested, but cautious. Morgan is now interested in read the tome too, maybe to help Rowan? Morgan left and Edgar wanted to watch TV. But he's talking to himself. Don't we just love Henford's sunrise? Nothing like a cold pizza for breakfast. While Rowan was busy working, Edgar asked for sex. Oh my God, Edgar, stop being so needy. Leave him alone. Get a job. Let the man work. In my main save, he's a freelance artist, so I gave him the same job. Oh my God. I saw the new fox fighting a rabbit, and I'm scared. Oh well, he ate the rabbit. You're evil. Morgan wants to come over again. I think Morgan wants to be part of this relationship, and I totally can see this becoming a through -ball. Edgar was interested in the fox, but when he saw Morgan, He greeted Morgan someone called him. You see, in my mind, Edgar is a bit innocent and he would totally say okay to this. It was Jacques Villarreal scamming him. He felt embarrassed when he realized what just happened. He was a bit upset and Morgan made him feel better afterwards. And the flirt begins again. Morgan is really enjoying spending time with Edgar. And I guess he likes to have them around. And at this point, I'm just accepting the fact that this is going to be a throuple. Because Rowan gets flirty when he sees Morgan every time. And again, he asked for magical training. Sims not facing each other is my pet peeve. Rowan is a good sim, so he would totally believe in Bess and give her the money. Our baby boy is sick, and since he's an alchemist, he prefers to treat himself with tea. He already feels better. A moment of Edgar not caring about the sun, just to pet the rabbit. Okay, not get out of there. Later, when he got thirsty, he asked to drink from Rowan. Of course, Rowan would let him drink from him. I guess the wounds from the mod I have. Conflicts with the Ombra hair accessory, lol. Rowan reading non-stop. For the love of God, Morgan is here again. Edgar let them in. Edgar is still thirsty and asked to drink from Morgan again. <laughs> oh. 
Rowan needs to find this cure ASAP. And apparently seeing his husband biting another sim makes him want to have sex. He really did ask in front of Morgan. And like I said, I love chaos. So I said yes. They danced in front of Morgan and they liked it, but tried to give them privacy. But this whole episode already made me fall in love with the idea of the three of them together. So I gave them all the polyamorous attribute from Wicked Whims. Should I move Morgan in with them? Make them human too? I've been pushing away. Rowan also bought Edgar an easel, so he has a lot of things to do. I don't know what to do. Need a sign from And this way he can finish the last tome he has to read. And he did it. He can make the cure now. He bought the ingredients. Be careful, Rowan. The ingredients were expensive. Won't you save, save, save? Oh my fucking god. He finished it, guys. I'm so happy. As if Vicky was feeling it. She asked to come to visit him. Edgar thanked him and drank the cure. I am out here alone. Now he's just a simple man. No more drinking from others, yay. They're so happy. It's time to celebrate. Vicky, you visited at the wrong time. Won't you save, 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 save me? Vicky hates the idea that her brother is a human now. Will she plot something to bring him back to the dark side? They went upstairs to celebrate and Vicky followed them. Just go away, girl. Stop looking at your sibling, Wolverine, and stop being bitter about this. Part of the magic things we can do. Edgar decided to be the one to carry their child. Trapped in this darkness for far too long. <laughs> and he's pregnant. Congrats. And he looked for Rowan to share the news. Oh, I've been seeking forgiveness. They are so happy to have their first baby. Let's hope it's a spellcaster. I think one baby might be enough. I have to stay strong. 